What is up guys, Ron Smith and in today's video we are going to look at how we can grow an engaging organic Instagram following in 2018. Stay tuned. Alright, so before we get into the actual video, if you love Instagram and you love growing and you love watching these kind of videos, please hit the subscribe button and hit the bell button to get notified when I upload. There's also coming out a new Instagram video next week which is going to teach the serious Instagram users that actually would invest into their accounts to grow super fast. But this video is for the guys that want to grow for free um, and this still works and it applies for people that are serious about their accounts as well. But uh, this is just some general Instagram rules to grow in 2018. How am I going to transition into my next clip? Alright, so before I give you the first five tips to grow fast on Instagram in 2018, I want to give you five pointers which you should not do in 2018, which will actually kill your account. So, let's get into it. Number one, don't buy fake followers or likes. It's just going to kill your account in the long run. Please, just don't do it. Number two, don't be that person that just posts so inconsistently like once a month or then all of a sudden 10 times a month. Stay consistent. Post once a day or twice a day or once a week. Uh, minimum, really minimum. Don't go less than a week. It just gives Instagram the idea that you're serious about your account and it makes them push up your page a lot easier. Number three. There is people that use hashtags correctly and then there's people that just use weird hashtags. So. If you're at a, if you have a picture on your feed that looks like you're going fishing, don't use the tag hashtag love or hashtag ocean or hashtag cute or... Alright, so point number four is don't dwell off of your niche. Um, if you have an a automotive niche, for example, don't be starting to post pictures of bikes or just random stuff that is not related to your feed. Uh, this is gonna kill your user base which you already have and um, Instagram is not gonna rank your account so you're not gonna get new followers or new likes. Just don't do it. Tip number five. Don't interact with users using the hashtags like for like, like for comment, follow for follow. You don't want to get involved over there because Instagram is not gonna rank your account if you do that because it does notice that so stay away from that. And now I'm going to give you guys five tips to grow organically in 2018. Let's get started. Tip number one is going to be stay related to your niche. If you are a, a car photographer, don't go and post a photo where you maybe took a picture of a bike or anything like that because the audience you have already have is not interested in seeing pictures of bikes. They want to see pictures of cars. So doing that is going to get them to unfollow you most probably and um, it's not going to boost up your post because that followers you have already is not going to like the picture so first off stick to your niche post what you always post and if you've always been posting stuff all around just get a niche and stick to it tip number two is going to be to leverage all the instagram features there is instagram loves pages that gets users to stay on the instagram platform platform for much longer so if you leverage the features like Instagram stories story highlights um, videos and photos and even live videos it's gonna show Instagram you're serious about your account and you're actually gonna get a lot of your Instagram followers to be longer on the Instagram platform itself and Instagram is gonna boost up your page because that is exactly what they want and that brings me to my next point. Keeping Instagram users on the Instagram platform is almost impossible without quality content. So whether you're a personal page and you create content or you're a theme page and you curate content, there is a few things that you need to keep in mind. If you're creating content yourself, make sure your lighting is very good and that you actually have something interesting in the photo which will attract a lot of users to interact on it. And if you have a theme page and you're posting curated content, the best tip I can give you is to post from off the oh, did I spit on the lens? Yes. The best tip I can give you is to post from off the explore page. I do this quite often with my accounts. Hit that search button and look for relevant posts to your post, which is already viral. 
that it's probably gonna be high quality content. So go and repost that. Just keep, make sure to give the guy credit that owns the content and you should be good to go. Tip number four is gonna be to rock that Instagram caption section of your post. It does make a big difference in your account. I cannot emphasize how much this has changed my account. So for example, you wanna have an engaging caption, like it has to start off with a question and then get the user to tag a few mates in the post and then uh, to hit the like button. So for example, with my automotive theme page, what I like to do is I like to curate content where there is two cars in the pictures uh, comparing each other. Let's say for example, an old Lamborghini at the top and a new Lamborghini at the bottom. And then in my caption, I will say top or bottom with a question mark and then tag a Lamborghini fan and then uh, double tap. So that gets the user to comment which one of the pictures in the one picture is his favorite, is the top picture his favorite or the bottom picture. Then it makes him to tag some of his mates that will really like that Lamborghini post and then hit the like button to make the post go viral as well. So that is really important. I can really not explain like how much this has changed my account. So if you have a personal page, this will work for it as well. It doesn't matter. Just get your user to engage on your photos to get viral on the explore page tip number five is not going to be hashtags all the youtubers is just saying hashtags hashtags and it is really important that you use relevant hashtags to your niche but even more important is that you engage with the people in your niche so once again for example my automotive page I will never go and like or comment or follow a user outside of the automotive niche. Why? Because Instagram won't be able to determine what your account is about. If you're an automotive page and you're liking makeup and you're liking BMXs and skateboarding and anything else but automotive, it's less likely to promote your page. So make sure that you like, follow and comment only on users posts that are in your niche guys and this is really so important and I know a lot of you guys can't do this, you don't have a lot of time and that is completely understandable. There is a few Instagram uh, growth services out there that actually does this for you on autopilot which is really great. I actually own a company that does this, securefame.com so if you guys want to check it out there will be a link in the description. Um, what it actually does, it logs into your account and likes comments and follows people in your niche and it unfollows them again. And then, um, yeah, it just works really well because, for example, if you have your page liking, commenting and following a person, the chances of them coming back to your account and doing the same with you is between 80 and 100%. So it's really good for growing fast on Instagram and organically. But um, yeah, more of that coming up next week. So make sure you hit the subscribe button, the bell button also to get notified. But um, yeah, that's going to be it for today's video, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this Instagram video. I love doing Instagram videos and I'm going to be doing quite a few of them. So as I said, stay tuned. But until next week or well, the next video, I'll probably try and upload a lot more often than usually. I actually uploaded like five months ago, so that's terrible. But anyway, guys, stay tuned for next week's video. And please hit the like button. It will really help my post to go viral on YouTube. And uh, comment what you guys thought about this video. Anyway, thanks a lot. Stay tuned.